Hi everyone, it's Jamie here from Michael Woods Sports and Leather Centre. And today I just put together a little kettlebell hit workout for you guys to do, okay? So we're going to be working for 40 seconds, we're going to have 10 second recovery time and change over period to get to that next exercise. We're going to repeat this circuit three to five times, okay? So we've got six exercises in total. Uh, what we need for our exercise today is we need a nice safe space to work out on, okay? So I'm in my kitchen um, working out today. We're going to have, I'm, I'm needing two lighter kettlebells and one slightly heavier kettlebell, if possible. And I uh, need that mat as well, okay? Remember, have yourself a lot of water, keep myself hydrated through a workout, always helpful as well. Okay, we're going to start off with a nice dynamic warm up, okay? So we're trying to pick the heart rate up here, we're trying to activate the muscles here, okay? So we're going to start off. A nice slight jog if you want to, just try again, try to pick that heart rate up, try to prepare yourself for exercise. What I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the music up a little bit. Always help you get in the mood. Come on, let's go. Tight circles with the arms, mobilise the shoulder joint. Opposite direction now. Tight circles. Just copy me and let's just go. Prepare ourselves for the exercise with our dynamic warm up. I keep my legs moving, keep my heart rate up. Let's go. Come on. Open up the chest now. Let's prepare ourselves. Let's go into the workout ready. Good. Keep it going. Open up the groins now. Across. Pick that leg up and across. Let's go. Do the opposite direction now. So up and in. Up and in. Up and in. Up and in. Keep it going. Good. So that job again, okay? The work up more on the back, the back muscles. With some deadlifts, okay, no weight. Feet shoulder width apart. Pushing the hips down, chest is pushed down. Up. We're going to do 10 of these. Alright, turn inside up, please. Push that bum right out. Get that chest pushed up. Go cover the spine. Good. Back that toe again. Just going to do some rotations now. Station for this. Let's go. Let's go in this workout with this positive attitude. Keep it going. So head rotations now as well. Let's get our muscles ready to go. Okay, it's a lunges now, five each leg. Get our back leg nice and low. Lunging forward. Three. Four. Six. Turn our leg up. Feel that the hamstring under the hips. Switch legs in. Good. Shake down the legs off here. Good one. Ten squats, okay? Push that bum down. Three, four, five. Come inside, don't you guys? They're giving our weight to the heel, pushing the bum back. Three, two more, four, fly up to the heels. And five, six, back that go again. We're just going to finish off our warm up. With 30 seconds, nice fast legs, okay? So bring the knees right up. And then we'll get into a workout. Three, two, 
One, let's go, get the legs moving. Get those knees right up. So nice deep breaths, okay? Nice deep breaths. I'm being ambitious so far. <laughs> Got my jumper on now. Sure that'll be off soon enough, okay? So like I said, we've got three to five rounds. Okay, we're gonna have a 45 second rest in between each, each uh, set, okay? So I'll write my timer on. Hope you're nice and warm now. So, first exercise, we have squat and press, focusing on our legs and our shoulders. I'm taking my light up kettlebells, I'm twisting them around. Okay, chest is pushed out, coming down, pushing through the heels, and then take that momentum and drive the kettlebell up. Down. Push that little back up and press the ceiling. Bring it down, let's go. Pushing those hips back, chest is pushed up. Drive the weight up. Use that momentum, you have created. Up and down. Press that kettlebell above your head. Let's go. Come side on for you. Pushing those hips back and up to the ceiling. Down. Fire through the heels. Recovery, change of work. Deadlift with an upright row, okay? So, we're pushing and we're pulling. We're pushed there. Now we're moving on to that pull exercise. Chest pushed out, okay? Up, and bring the kettlebell up. Well, let's work. Here's an absolute nightmare. Can I wait for them? Barber still for up again. <laughs> Keep it going, okay? Technique controlled. Okay, if we're not erratic, everything's controlled in our movement. Bring that kettlebell right up, down to the floor. Push the bum right back. Bring the kettlebell up. Got all down. Three, two, and one. Again, recovery feeling. We go down to the mat. This time, work core exercise. And once you're that, it's a torso twist. Be a crossed over. Let's go. Twist that kettlebell over, okay? Try to keep the legs still. Use your core muscles to move that weight. Good, keep it going, come on. Feel that burn in your stomach muscle. Let's make it uncomfortable. Take a weight that makes it challenging for you. Good, come on, all left now. 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, three two, two, one. Come on up. Next exercise, we're on to the goblet squat. So we take the heavier of the two kettlebells. We're holding the kettlebell by the lungs, chest pushed up, pushing the hips back, going nice and low. Try to do that 90 degree angle on that knee. Okay, pushing through those heels again. 10 seconds gone, come on. We're coming down and we're breathing out on the way up. We breathe in on the way down and breathe out on the way up, okay? Push those hips back and up. Again, all the weight is through that heel. Come on, guys. Hard work and all. This jumper's coming off soon. <laughs> Good. Five seconds remaining. Come on, keep it going. Three, Three two, two one. and one. Next exercise. We're doing a bent over row with the kettlebells. Again, we're using back muscles, okay? So, Three, taking these kettlebells a lighter two. Leaning forward, pushing the chest out. Bring the weights up. 
Three minutes, you come up, and three minutes, you go down, okay? So the side on for you guys. Okay, we don't want that curb spine, we want that chest push right out. Good, keep it moving. Squeeze those shoulder blades together at the back. We're halfway now. Let's keep this workout going. Do not quit on me. Push that bum right out. Really pull those kettlebells up. Five, four, three, two, one. And recover there. This time, we have a kettlebell sit up. Again, core exercises. Feet on the floor. Kettlebells in front of you. You sit up. The kettlebell comes above your head. Again, concentrate on that muscle we're using. We're using these core exercises. Bring it up. Three bounds, we come up. Kettlebell comes in front of you. You sit up. Then it comes above your head. 20 seconds left. Dig in. Dog's not happy. It's okay. <laughs> that is just for striking until fit. Come on. Sitting up. Three, two, one. And recover. That is our first round done. We're taking 45 seconds. Try to reduce that heart rate, okay? Get a bit warmer. Ooh. Tell you what, I'm glad I never had the heat on this morning. Ooh. Hope you enjoyed it so far. So that's round one. Again, three to five rounds are going for. We'll see how I got on today, okay? I'm gonna try to keep the jump on one more round, okay? Get that sweat on. Let's go. So we have 15 seconds to go until our next round begins, okay? Again, if there's any exercises you can sore, don't do them. They maybe have an injury, okay? So uncomfortable we want, not painful, okay? So moving on. Again, we're back to squat and press. Bring that bum down nice and low, and then use that momentum, drive the weight up. Pushing the hips back and up. Breathe in all the way down, and then truly breathe out and push up all the way up. Good, come on! Over halfway now. I know it's getting tough, I'm feeling it now as well. Turn the side on for you again. Push the hips back and drive up. Great work. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great, come on. We're feeling better. We're feeling motivated. Let's go. Let's keep this positive vibe going. Moving on. Deadlifts again. Up. Breathe out and we up, okay? Driving up with that weight. Good. Hinging forward and up. Good, keep the exercise flowing. Keep it going. I'll turn the side on for you guys. Again, chest push right up. Breathe out that way up. Good, keep it going. 10 seconds remaining now. Dig in. Keep that breathing steady and controlled if you can. Woo! Woo! Down. We're going on to core exercise now. We're going torso twist again. Onto the mat. Feet crossed over. Twisting. Let's go. I know it's tough. We need to dig in. We need to get ourselves fitter. Harder to work here, the better we'll feel at the end. Twist over. Come on! Try to smile as you do it. No easy. Over halfway. Three, two, one. And we've come over there. Good. Next exercise. We're moving on. Goblet squat. Okay. Moving back into the lower body again. Nice take up the, the horns, push the hips back and up, okay? So don't let those knees come past the toes. You really initiate that movement by pushing your bum back. Push and pull exercise, guys. Plenty of squats in this, okay? Feel this in the legs at the end. Quads. 
I'm going to do this, you'll feel it. Fun, baby. Five. Three. Two. One. We're coming there. Bend over the row again. Move on to the back muscles again. Moving really forward, chest pushed out. Elbow squeeze in, let's go. Again, we're going to try and handle all these big muscle groups in the body today, guys. Sweat should be dripping from you now. It's still less from me. Now one more round of it and the jumper's off. Things are harder than you can't see. We're here to be past your life. Nightmare. Three legs to come up. Three legs to come down. Come on. Five, four, three, three two, two, one. one. Great, well done. Good work, everyone. Moving on. Again, core exercise. Three, Get on them set up. Feet flat on the floor. Get up in front of you. Up. Play that kettlebell above your head. Three bounces to come up. Woo! Come on! Getting tough now. Promise you, the harder we work though at the end, we feel better. Oh, 20 seconds left, yes! Come on! Kettlebell comes in front of you. Come on up. Use those core muscles to drive that weight up. I've got 45 seconds now. Jump on top. Whew, that's better. Just take that recovery, okay? Just keep yourself moving. Try not to sit down. Just keep walking around the room, okay? Whew. Okay, we've got 20 seconds left on recovery, guys. Enjoy that recovery before we move into round three. Get more challenging, the exercise will get hard. So not let that technique sacrifice go. You're not going to lose the technique, yeah? Focus on each rep, get the most out of each rep, okay? We're moving on again, squat and press with the kettlebell, lighter kettlebell. Up, twist the kettlebell round. Okay, we're coming down nice and low. And we're up. There's our rep one, let's go. Three bounce, drive that weight up, good. Let's make the most of this work here, guys. Really pushing these hips back, pushing right back, and coming up, driving that weight up. Again, focus on that technique, coming down, driving the weight up. Five seconds. Three, two, one. 10 second recovery. Let's get prepared. Let's get ready for the next exercise. Deadlands. But not right row. Let's go. Up. Good. Nice and controlled. Breathe out of the way up. Using our back muscles and our leg muscles here. Let's go. Breathe out. Breathe out. Breathe out as we come down. Come on. Let's feel great after that one, you guys. Keep smiling. <laughs> yes. Try to keep the movement going the whole time. Three, two, one. Recover there. Woo. Woo. Back down. Core exercise again. Torso twist. You should know it by now. Back down the floor. Feet thrust over. We're twisting. Let's keep up the exercise flowing. Take on the challenge today. I've sent a whole watch in this. Let's get up, grab our kettlebells if we have some, and go for it. This exercise, you can take it rather than get out the kettlebell, you can do it without the kettlebell there. I'm just adding that kettlebell for that extra challenge. Good. Twist. Good, come on. Five, four, three, two, 
And on. We're moving on. Goblet squat again. We take the heavier kettlebell. Again, you can do this with no weight at all. It's up to you what weight you find challenging. 40 seconds of goblet squat. It's not easy. Try to keep the elbows tucked into the body. Keeping that chest pushed out. Pushing the hips back, okay? Nice tight grip on that weight. Keeping the weight flowing through the heel. Breathing in as we come down. Breathing in as we come up. 10 seconds remaining, guys. It's not easy. It's not meant to be easy. We're trying to get ourselves fitter. We're trying to progress with our, with our training, okay? Next exercise. Again, bent over row. Back and biceps exercise. Taking the lighter weight again. Hinging forward, chest pushed out, and squeeze those shoulder blades together. Good. A lot of legs and back in this workout, okay? Try and keep the exercise flowing if you can. If you need a couple of seconds to recover, just do it. As soon as you feel you're recovered, back on it again. Turn it sideways for you guys. Good, 10 seconds remaining now. Woo, I'm sweating now. Three, Three two, two, one. Two. Good, well done. Woo, recovery. Okay, now, again, second of our core exercises is again, we're set up with that kettlebell. Kettlebell in front of us. Up we come. Now, three minutes to come up. Three better to come back. Whoa. Under 20 seconds now, guys. Come on, right up. Wow, wow, 45 seconds guys, recover, so often you get away, the shoes in the house, <laughs> who's working so well, let's be real there, the shoes in the house, <laughs> you get shot otherwise, <laughs> again just trying to cover, keep that deep breathing going, Woo! look at this here, wow, <laughs> Kitchen scissors will be coming out soon, I think. <laughs> so we have 10 seconds to get it to recover, guys. We're going on to the next exercise again. We're going to get back to squat and press. Legs and shoulders, okay? Really driving up and pushing that weight up. Let's get ready. Light up kettlebells up. Let's go. Down and up. Driving up. Oh, come on. Halfway there, guys. You can keep it going. Oh, ten seconds left. Again, push that up back. Fire through the heels. Drive the weight up. Okay. Use that momentum from the squat and add it to the press. Recover. We're on round four now, guys. It's starting to get tough here, okay? Dead left, we're up right row again. Up right row. Breathe out. Cool, let's keep this moving. Chest is pushed up. Do not suffer that technique, okay? We'll come side on again. Okay, we're halfway there. Push the hips back. Chest is pushed out, I'm not rounded back, I'm chest pushed up. We're bringing that upright going as well. Come on, let's go. Oh, dearly me. What are we on next? Five. Three, two, one. twist again, light up kettlebell, back with the floor. 
Dorsal twist. Feet thrust over. Keep that deep, breathe in deep. And control. It's getting tough now, everyone. This is where we don't give in. This is where we work through it. 15 seconds left. Control the weight with your core muscles. Three, Three, two, one, back up off the floor. Nice quick changeover, okay? We're moving on to the goblet squats now. Heavier squats. Okay, with that nice heavy weight, borne by the horns. Pushing the hips back. Our feet are slightly away from the shoulder width. We're pushing the hips back and we're driving up through the heels. Woo, I'm sweating now. <laughs> sweating now. Try and keep those elbows stuck in, guys. Keep it moving. Do not give in. This is when it starts getting tough, everyone. Halfway there. 20 seconds left. Woo! Ha ha ha! I still see those things again, guys. 10 seconds left. Push those hips right back, nice and low. Wow! Three moves and come up. Fire through those heels! Come on! Woo! Again, we'll take it too light of kettlebells, bend over low, back and biceps, focus on those muscles, hinging forwards, chest pushed out. Woo! Tough, turn aside on again, please. 30 seconds left, okay? We're in round four now. Only one more round to go after this. Again, if you're really struggling, go on wrong, we've come in short in four rounds. I'm going to push on and go to number five. Ten seconds left. Keep those elbows close to the body. Bring the shoulder blades together. Three, two, one. Throw it in. Ten seconds to come to there, guys. We move on to the kettlebell shots again. Feet flat on the floor. Lying back. Tail bell in front of you. Drive up. Dig in. Let's get the most out of each exercise. Squeeze that core. Oh, we're halfway now. Oh, it's burning now. Ten seconds left. Keep smiling, keep ourselves positive. We'll feel great in the end. Well done. Woo! Moving on. 45 seconds recovery. Hope you guys all keep doing well with this uh, 100 mile challenge. Yeah? The trust are doing so we're running or walking 100 miles. Yeah? Hope you're all doing well with that. A lot of these exercises will make us more powerful runners as well. Now recover. Try to just start that rate. Okay, we've got one final round to go. Stay with me. Keep ourselves motivated, yeah? One final round. Woo! Again, start with that shoulder press. Let's get our kettlebells ready. Twisting around. Really pushing back through the hips. Driving up. And take that momentum to the ceiling. Breathe in. Breathe out. Coming down low. Push that hips back. And up. Legs and shoulders, guys. Driving up. Really feel it. Power up. Coming down. Good. Ten seconds remaining. Get the most out of every rep. Breathe in. And breathe out. Come on! Woo! <laughs> 10 seconds recovery, everyone. We get a heavier kettlebell. And the exercise now, remember, is the last time we do it. Deadlift, upright row. Deadlift, upright row. Ah! ah. Okay, keep all that power through your heel. Bring the weight nice and high. 
engine forward, chest is pushed out, no curve in the spine, we're halfway there now. Ah, breathe out. Ah. Less than 10 seconds now everyone. Let's keep those reps going. Three, two, one. Oh, I'm glad that's last time doing that. Okay, torso twist again. So we take one of the lighter kettlebells, we come down on the mat, feet crossed over, torso twist. Breathe, keep on breathing. Nice deep breaths. Hopefully see you guys in the gym so you can tell me if you enjoyed this or not. I'm going to be hating after that. <laughs> Whew. 20 halfway. seconds left everyone. We're over halfway now. Keep that exercise flowing. Keep the core working. Whew. 10 seconds left. Up this with three more exercises. You'll feel great at the end. Three, two, one, oh. rest. Okay, three more exercises like I said. We move on to our goblet squat. We have our elbows tucked in. Taking the kettlebell. Hold it by the horns. Coming down nice and low and up. Breathe in, breathe out. Again, connect that mind to muscle connection. We're using the legs, we're using the glutes, we're using the quads. Focus on them. Driving up. Elbows tucked in. Woo! 20 seconds left. Yeah, third side on, 15 to go. <sighs> 10 seconds left, guys. Woo. Three, two, one. Rest. Oh, rest there, recover there. Let's get ready for that changeover. Then over rows again. Two light of kettlebells. I get a hinge forward, chest pushed up. Back and biceps. Breathe out. Breathe out. Keep it controlled. Keep the reps of high quality. Keep it going. Nice solid base. Feet, shoulder width, apart. Pull it one more exercise after this, guys. Then we get to cool down. We get to recover our heart rate. And we'll finish off with a cool down and stretching. Two, one. Oh, wow. Last exercise. Kettlebell set up to the end. We're down onto the mat. So, okay, just trying to just that hard right again. Don't move on our stretches, good at shaking things off. Woo. Okay, start off our body. We're going to stretch our shoulders off. Feet shoulder width apart. We're up nice and tall. We're going to take a left arm and bring it across our body. Above or below that elbow. Just squeezing that arm in. Should feel it across the shoulder there. Hold each stretch. 10 to 15 seconds. Switch into the opposite side. Bring that arm in and pull it into the body. The 
When I move the head now, just put a little bit of pressure down. Don't press, put pressure on the joint. Okay, but we'll just roll it. Push him down. Hope you all enjoyed that today, guys. Tough. Sweating now. Switching sides. I went for a shower before I filmed this. <laughs> so I could make myself look presentable. And now look at me. Waste a lot more, eh? Shocking. <laughs> okay. Hands lower back. Yeah, we'll squeeze those elbows together. We'll use a little bit of our chest when we're doing that shoulder press, okay? So a good stretch across the chest. Squeezing those elbows in together. Again, from the sides, we're there. Feet shoulder lift still. Core nice and tight. We're not blocked over. Our posture is always, always great throughout the exercise. Again, slight bend in those knees. Or soft knees. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to stretch the backs off now, okay? So, we're just going to come down on all fours. Yeah, arms below the shoulders. Okay, pushing the chest out, wraps in the back. I'm going to come up. Pull the tummy away from the mat. Keep your breathing nice, steady, and controlled. Just do this a couple of times. Great work at the day, everyone. One more, I'll do one more. Push that one way back, I'll put the chest out. We're coming up. Woo! Roasting, roasting. Glad I've got the heat on this morning. <laughs> okay, so we're dropping on down to the lower body now. I'm going to go on to hamstrings, okay? Hands on that bent leg, chest is pushed out. Push the hips back. If you sink the hips further back, you'll feel a greater stretch of the hamstring. Again, try to keep the chest pushed out. Stretching the opposite side, guys. Pushing those hips back. Right, moving on. Quadriceps, okay? So. I'm using my kitchen cupboard to hold on to for balance. Okay, so if you've got something to balance, to, please do so. Again, legs close together, pushing the hips forward, slight bend in that standing leg. Again, if there's any exercise you're struggling with, you're looking for different exercises, feel free to comment. Um, you can offer a different exercise if there's one of the ones you couldn't do in the workout. So we just slightly change it for you. Switching legs, okay. Push those hips further forward and you'll feel that greater stretch in your quadriceps. It's your last stretch. Okay, I'm going to do that foot across. And push the hips back, try and get nice and low. Hopefully you get lower than me, I'm steady. And you feel that right in there. Sinking the hips right back. And try and get that a little bit lower, okay? Sliding up, sliding a quick drink. The last step, bring that foot across, dropping that down. Throughout today's workout, just keep yourself drinking your water, keep yourself hydrated. Okay, push those hips right down. We're going to rise up. Again, I feel a shoulder of the part, so we've got a torso twist there. I'm going to finish with a couple of nice deep breaths to finish our workout out today. Okay, so nice deep breath in, cross the arms over, bring up the ceiling, and then breathe out. Two more. Deep breath in, right up to the ceiling, and then breathe out. Last one. Crossing over, right up to the ceiling, breathing in, and breathing out. And then just shake on the muscles off there, guys. And if you've done the workout today, great work. Here's another round of applause. I'll hopefully see you in the gym soon.